we talked about your uh, loose skin earlier. And uh, so mm-hmm. I wanted to circle back to that. Are, sure. Have you seen uh, any improvement on that? Are, are you doing anything mm-hmm. to try to get that tightened up or is surgery, sure. do you think, probably the only option? Well, I, I think, I mean, like to be a hundred percent honest, I don't think my skin, why do I keep saying that? I keep saying to you, honestly, like, like I'm lying. Um, <laughs> like, <laughs> um, but no, like, my skin is probably not as bad as some other people's that I've seen that have lost as much weight as I have. Um, I think that's a combination of things. I think it has to do with, you know, my primarily whole foods diet. I think I I've mixed a fair amount of, of intermittent fasting and extended fasting in there. I know people say there's some theories that that can help, you know, I've been a regular consumer of collagen. Does that help? I don't know. Like, I, I don't think there's one answer that really can help. Um, I do have a significant amount of it though. I just think pictures don't always show it. So I, I think it's something, you know, that's really there. My, at my heaviest, my waist was 84 inches. Like my waist now is closer to 36. So right. there's clearly a dimension shift there that's going to leave something behind. And so I do think that surgery probably at the end of the day is one of the only things that could take it away completely. I, I'm also very much a chicken and don't have the funding for the, for the surgery as, you know, most insurance won't cover it completely. Um, so it's not something I worry about right now. It's something I'm, I'm more tasked myself with being okay with and seeing as, you know, a badge of, of the journey that I've made and having to see it as something that tells my story before I get to tell my story myself. Like if people see it or get to, you know, I've had my shirt come up at the gym and had people, you know, see my stomach and immediately be like, oh my God, how much weight have you lost? Like, I, I think there's, there's something unique. I think there aren't that many of us that, you know, live with that. And I also know, you know, from what I've, the research I've done and doctors I've talked to that, you know, as you heal and as you kind of find your maintenance place, you know, your skin will change again, like not necessarily retract completely, but kind of find the place it's going to get to. So for me, I feel like that's really about waiting a couple of years to see where I'm at and then determining if there's something I need, I want to do about it or even could do about it at that point. 